Police in New Jersey are searching for a suspect who they say shot and killed a beloved animal control officer. Law enforcement sources say they don't believe the murderer on the run was a stranger. CBS 2's Christine Sloan has the story new at 530. Right here. This is the spot where Larry Carrington's brother died in his arms after being shot by a suspect. I tried to save him, you know. That's that's what any any brother would do. And I couldn't I couldn't I couldn't couldn't bring him back. 43-year-old Aldous Carrington, a well-respected animal control officer in the city, was on duty Tuesday night, stopping by his house on Wainwright Street to bring his wife a soda when he was killed on the sidewalk in front of his wife and brother. He walked up to him and put it to his head because he had powder burns from the bullet hole around in his head. Then he worked 16 years. Did you look at the guy who did this? He just had a black hoodie on, you know, and, um, no one seen where he came from. He might have came from behind that abandoned house right there. He might have just been waiting for him. While Larry Carrington believes his brother may have been targeted on his overnight shift because of his job investigating animal abuse, prosecutors say they don't have a motive, but that the shooting was not random. I'm just really numb right now. Fellow officers at the Humane Society of New Jersey say Carrington was the best, rescuing thousands of dogs, most of them injured in dog fights. He kind of um, was like the standard down here. He was here the longest. He trained the other guys. Carrington's brother says the suspect ran down the street right past surveillance cameras. Sources tell me investigators are looking at video from that camera to see if they have a clear shot of the suspect. In Newark, Christine Sloan, CBS 2 News. And Newark's new police director says while robberies and shootings are down, homicides are up by 18%.